at a distance of 10 meters is a big palm tree. Through it is the general direction of the north. So these confused people thought there was a gap. But we have now brought more soldiers, created more units. You should tell all those cattle wrestlers that they will very soon lose appetite for the gun. So therefore, I congratulate the army leaders, the commandant of the college here, trainers, and the trainees. I congratulate you. You, 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 you performed well down there in the, at the shooting range, although it was rainy. <laughs> Uh, and even here, I could only really see, see a few mistakes of people who did not uh, synchronize well. But otherwise, the whole group uh, did well. I congratulate everybody. It is therefore my, uh, my, my obligation now, my duty now, under the laws of Uganda and the constitution of the country, to pass you out because you have finished your course properly. You are passed out by my orders. Thank you very much. This is a, a division training school. Uh, still a lot is lacking, but we are doing everything possible to make this place a better place for training and for the instructors to say to stay in it. The army is not a job. It is about to service to our people. And uh, it is very important that you look at it from that angle. If you came here to look for a job, then you will be disappointed. I will only leave you to go with the um, a reading from the book of Luke, where John was going to preach uh, about the repentance and the coming of the kingdom. And he was telling people to repent and change their ways of uh, uh, doing things. And he told them that you need to do Good things. If you do them, then you will be blessed, and you will, your sins will be forgiven, and you will be able to go to uh, to heaven. So, so many people came to him, including soldiers. In Luke chapter three, verse fourteen, and I'm going to read it, read it verbatim. This is what he told the soldiers when soldiers came to him. 
And uh, I always regret it from my good news Bible. There are so many Bibles, but I never use the good news. It says, some soldiers also came to him and asked, what about us? What should we do? He said to them, don't take money from anyone by force. Two, do not accuse anybody falsely. Three, be contented with your pay. Those are the three things I leave with you. If you are to stay in UPDF, please do not grab anybody's things. Do not grab anybody's wife. Do not take anybody by force. Do not accuse anybody falsely. Do your work. Do it very well. And be happy with the pay you get. Here, it's not about pay. It's about service.